first graders. Next, we're going to read a book called My Community. What is a community? A community is a group of people that live, work, and play in the same area. Communities are found all over the world. Every community is different. People can be part of many different communities at the same time. Different communities. Some communities are very small, such as a community in a neighborhood. Other communities are very big. Whole countries can be communities. We live in a village community. Some communities live in villages. Other communities live in cities. What's a community you can think of right now that you're a part of? Maybe your neighborhood or your school, Clinton, or the fact that you live in this country is a community. Living in a community makes it easy to make friends and work with others. We can learn about others and celebrate things that make us the same and different. Communities can also help you feel like you belong. Different cultures. People from different cultures often live in the same community. Learning about the different cultures in our communities helps us see how we are all unique. Communities often celebrate di the different cultures that they include with events such as parades. People who help you. People in a community work together. They help and care for each other. Each person helps make their community a better place. Some people in a community have special jobs that help keep the community safe. Police officers make sure that everyone follows the law. They also help keep us safe. They are the people we call when we need help. Firefighters help people who are in danger from fires. They also put out fires. Doctors are people who look after you when you are sick. They help keep their communities healthy. Teachers help you learn how to read and write. They also teach us how to treat others with respect. At school. Every school is a community. A school community includes your classmates, teachers, and anyone else at school, such as volunteers, janitors, and your principal. You can make your school community a good place to learn by being kind to your classmates, listening to your teacher, and respecting others. At home. The people in your family are often part of the same communities that you are, such as your neighborhood community or your culture. Your family can help teach you about the communities you are a part of. Global community. Even though people belong to many different culture communities, we all also belong to one big global community. We all share Earth, the planet where we live. All right, that's the end. Thanks for listening, first graders. Go ahead and pause the video now and think about all of the different communities that you're a part of. You can write them down, talk to your parents or your siblings about them, and maybe try and see how many you can come up with that you all belong to.